Say, come on, Barbie, let's go party. Ooh, 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 yeah. <laughs> Tone deaf. You don't have to have a massive budget to have an on-trend home. Showroom Steals is all about breaking down the trends that you would see in a designer showroom, but we show you how you can get the look for less. Hello everyone, I am so glad that you're here for another episode of Showroom Steals. We have a super exciting episode today. We're talking about something that is near and dear to my heart and maybe yours as well. Do you have any guesses? Drum roll please. We are talking about Barbie core. Okay, so what is the deal with Barbie core? You guys have all probably seen that Ryan Gosling and Margot Robbie are starring in the upcoming Barbie film. I swear, every time a picture is leaked from their set, it is all over the internet and it's all we see for two days straight. People are obsessed. And because the film is so popular and there's so much hype around it, we're seeing people dress like Barbie, there's new products coming out, it's showing up in TV and commercials, and it's even showing up in people's homes. So what we're gonna talk about today is how to bring that Barbie core style to your own home. So what is Barbie core? It's pretty much exactly what it sounds like. We're talking pink, ultra feminine, over the top style. Think Elle Woods in Legally Blonde or Cher from Clueless. Aside from being unapologetically pink, try out furniture with rounded edges. It'll help you play up that dollhouse vibe without going too over the top. And did I mention we're gonna be using lots of pink? To even out what can be an overwhelming color, it's great to pull in some plush fabrics to soften things up. We're talking shag rugs, tufted leather, velvet curtains. Those details add this luxe, glamorous feel to bring this childhood fantasy into adult life. Today, I'm gonna to break down the trend in an office space. So to get our Barbie dream home started, the first thing we're gonna pick out is a rug. It's a base layer for your office and also just sets the tone for the rest of the design. Today, I've picked out this bright fuchsia one, which is really bold and goes along with that Barbie theme. But what's great about it is that it brings in different tones of pink, so it's not just one layer of pink throughout your entire office. And you'll see it has these blues, greens, teals, yellows, lots of different accent colors that you can weave in as you're decorating your Barbie office. So this one that I have in front of me is a four by six. I'd recommend if you have a bigger office doing an eight by 10 and that size is actually under $200, which is unheard of for that size rug. For a four by six, if you have a smaller office, maybe you're living in a city or you've got a tight office space, this one's under $60, which you really can't beat that. Okay, so next we're gonna talk about desks. I was truly blown away to figure out how expensive desks could really be. So today we've got a budget-friendly option. It's around $250 and it's bubblegum pink, which what gets more Barbie than that? It's got this gold detailing on it as well, which just sort of ups the glam and we all know that Barbie is the most glamorous girl in all the land. If you want something that is even more budget-friendly, I've got an awesome hack for you guys. It might sound a little bit silly, but check out kids' furniture. This desk is only a few inches smaller and it's only $100. It's the perfect hack to get you that bubblegum pink look at a price that's even lower than what you were expecting. So you can't have a good desk without a great chair to sit in. We know Barbie is of course in her office closing huge business deals, so she's gotta have a fabulous chair to sit in while she does that. This pink shag option is so fun and really fits the bill when it comes to fabulous. Can't you just see Elle Woods sitting in this chair studying for her LSATs? So now let's talk about bringing in some additional seating. These chairs are some of my favorite items in this entire room. They're clear plastic and bring in those rounded edges that we talked about that sort of soften up the room and also give you that dollhouse vibe. They literally look like you plucked them straight out of Barbie's dream house and just scaled them to size. They're also only $100. And if you were to find these chairs elsewhere, they might run you about $800 a pop. Because of their price point and the super popular style, you might find that they're out of stock when you go to look for them. The good news is you can sign up for restock notifications or just filter by clear accent chairs on our website and you can find lots of other options. So now let's talk about layering and some pillows. They add some softness, some coziness, and just make your office a place you really wanna hang out. This option from Origin 21 is of course pink. We know that's the theme of the day today. And these pom-poms all around the edge are just so fun and playful and feel like it came straight out of a dollhouse. Swapping out your lighting in your office can make a huge impact, so try bringing in some glam elements like a chandelier. We picked out this crystal option that's around $100 and it just instantly elevated the entire office. And at $100, it truly is a showroom steal because chandeliers can be astronomically expensive. Bookshelves are a great option for filling out any empty space you might have in your office. We found these white bookshelves from Allen & Roth that are around $100, which is a great price point, and they're ladders that lean against the wall, which is just really fun. When you start to fill them out with books and knickknacks, I'd recommend color coding your books because it makes a big impact. 
Now let's add some curtains to the room. Today, we've picked out these beautiful curtains that are in this nice blush pink color. What's great about that color is that it's not as bold as some of the other pink we have in the room. So it softens things up and really just pulls the whole room together. One of my favorite things about these curtains is the texture on them. I have to show you guys how beautiful it is. It's a subtle floral texture that's not too over the top, but pulls in that super feminine Barbie vibe. Now it's time for the best part, bringing in tons of fun decor to round out your room. I personally love bringing in plants, candles, decorative books, and artwork to make the room really feel like your own. And don't forget, you can also shop stuff you already have in your house to make your bookshelves more full and add personal details to your entire room. And now your Barbie dream office is officially ready for you to take on the world. So what do you think? Have we gone totally Barbie crazy or do you love the trend? Let us know what you think in the comments and be sure to like, subscribe, and tune in next time.